Hello Libra, welcome to Sidekick Tarot. I'm Ryan, and thank you for being here. It's going to be a general reading, so everything may not resonate. Take what does and leave the rest. And for more tarot readings after this, go ahead and check out my wife's channel, the Val 53 Tarot, which is a review as well. Thank you. You're starting by pulling your current or overall energy. And then we'll be going into clarifiers. Okay, I'll get the cards out first, and then I'll begin. Um, one more. Interesting. Okay, Libra, jumping into this right away, what you are showing me, you're definitely being very fair and neutral right away. Now, whatever this is, <laughs> whatever this is you are moving towards, it is definitely some type of new beginning, or you are making some type of decision here to try something different for yourself. Um, not too sure exactly what is going on, because immediately what you're showing me is you are kind of treading very cautiously. And this is, well, there is quite a bit of anxiety and stress here going on internally. I'm not too sure what this is about. I kind of feel like it could be some type of financial endeavor, but we'll see through the clarifiers. Um, ultimately, what you're saying is overall with the way things are moving forward, as they kind of are, um, you're ultimately having to make some sort of assessment and judgment call as to what you truly want to do. And so right now, what you're choosing to do is kind of just rest, recover, take it easy. But I do see that overall with the situation, you are wanting to remain pretty adamant about pursuing this goal which you are doing and you're kind of saying, well, I am pretty much in control. I'm doing what I need to do to remain confident in rest and recover. At the same time, you're also showing me you're not entirely fulfilled about how things are going with work, with career, with finances. Like I said, it does feel money related, uh, but ultimately you are making some sort of decision here regarding commitment or dedication as to what you truly want to do. And ultimately you're saying is I'm going to make that decision regarding commitment dedication based off of my own personal truth. Okay, let's go ahead and jump into clarifiers and see what we can find. I will say that whatever this endeavor is, is beginning to slightly take its toll on you energetically. Um, let's see. Whoa, 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 whoa. There is a connection here between you and someone that you're wanting to talk to. Okay. You're going to just send that message, send that DM, contact them, call them, email them, whatever this is. Um, you're saying it's a little bit risky, but... Hmm. Interesting. Risky. A risky connection? What's that about? Whoa. <laughs> it's like the card reeled itself back in. <laughs> interesting. Very interesting. Yeah, you have some sort of strategy or plan here regarding work and finances, but 
Okay, so you're definitely, I feel like, like, again, it goes back to finances and investments. You got something in mind here you're kind of mulling over. Um, well, you have ideas in mind, but... Yeah, you have ideas in mind, but you're choosing to kind of wait. And again, it's like... Um, It's fascinating. It's almost like you're you're determining how you want to go approaching them, I feel. I, I believe I told Virgo that. It's like, don't think too hard. Don't think too hard. Don't think too much. Otherwise, everything kind of stops and doesn't progress, doesn't move forward at all, even in, including even your own energy. You're like, do I, don't I? Do I, don't I? How do I? It's like... Jeez, you're, you're, yeah, Libra, Libra, Libra. And so scales, constantly trying to find balance. Um, do you, don't you, do you, don't you, do you, don't you? This is actually, like I said, this is actually kind of like, you know there's a decision here you need to make, but it's actually like emotionally disappointing. going on here okay okay so you're you're happy about the stability you're happy about your foundation there's a lot of emotional investment commitment energy interested as well and put into that but then I'm a little curious about what's going on Mmm, the juggle, the juggle. This is a juggle between work, finances, investments, and love. And that's what's fascinating. You're kind of showing me that you are in the process of gaining further balance for yourself. Um, but I feel like it is, it's it's more so towards your finances, investments. But I feel like you're kind of showing me this energetic, like a blind spot of, well, it actually is regarding me and someone with this connection, but it's like, Even you're kind of like, do I, don't I, do I, don't Like I said, it's like, if you have to ask yourself that many times, do you, don't you, do you, don't you, it's probably a no. It's probably a no. Oh, boy. Um, <laughs> yeah, you're trying to play it cool. You're trying to play it cool. And that's what's fascinating, though, is whoever this person is you, you, or whatever this connection is, you definitely want to work or possibly collaborate with them. There's something here that you're kind of holding yourself back from. So you yourself are holding yourself back, Libra. Um, so in a sense, you are getting in your own way. Unless there's some type of reason or circumstances you can't just outright directly approach them or communicate. That makes sense, but... You're trying to figure out if something or someone is worth fighting for. Once again, it's the same. It goes, I'll throw it right back at you. If you don't know, if you're like, do I, don't I, do I, don't I, do I, don't I, they'll probably no. You're doing what you can. You're definitely doing what you can, but at the same time, it's like the whole the whole situation, the whole scenario is it's it's definitely heartbreaking. It's like mm, this is very difficult. It's very like hard to process and acknowledge, even though you're showing me that it's like taking so much of your time, energy, and focus. Um, and that's what's crazy is I believe I told someone else this. I can't exactly recall who. Um, but 
But what you're ultimately saying is that the pain is so very difficult to kind of just get over and just kind of let go of. And that's why you're, you're, you're back and forth here, Libra. You are. But at the same time, I, I do feel, well, I can't do this. I can't show that card. But um, you do know that there's a decision regarding commitment that you got to make. Yeah, you're saying you're overburdened, overstressed. You feel like something was a complete loss or someone was a complete loss. And there is possibly someone here with you. Because of it all. Not as in they're the reason or the cause for anything. It's just they are, you know, with you or possibly a few are with you. Um Understandable. They're definitely understandable. <laughs> At the same time, you are realizing your truth. And you're like, you know what? I'm going to do what I need to do for me. And I feel like you're going to do that very quickly. And ultimately what you're saying is it's almost like you're rushing over to your phone or something and you're getting ready to communicate or contact. Well, you've chosen Libra. So sometimes it just takes a little bit of uh, pressure. Of course, if you are dealing with anyone who do have showing up, Gemini, Leo, Capricorn, Leo, Aries, and that is all. Goodbye.